What's up, Digivestors? Welcome back to the channel. It's Alex. Oh my god, what is going on with Solana and Solana meme coins? Meme coins are popping off all across the board, you guys. This is just insane. We've called almost every single play correctly on this channel so far. Um, and I'm really excited for what the future brings with a lot of these coins, you guys. I think that there is still room to run. I'm going to show you guys why. We'll take a look at total three, total two charts. Um, I'm going to bring you guys a quick update video here on Samoid coin, uh, as well as uh, some of the other Solana meme coins that are going off, especially Bonk. As you guys can see right here, Bonk is now number three in all of in all the meme coins. This is just insane. It's actually in the top 100 coin now. Number 81, it beat Pepe, and it's currently sitting at a 739 million market cap. I brought this coin to you guys when it was, I, I think, around 15 to 20 million in market cap. So this thing did a 30x from when, where I, when I called this thing. If you were paying attention, you made a lot of money, 30x your money. And you guys, the volume is insane, 161 million. I don't see how pip, uh, how uh, Bonk doesn't get listed on Binance soon, you guys. I think that's just inevitable. Um, the price is currently at 0 0.00001219. Um, if you take a look a little bit further down the list, Samoid coin, look at this, 67 million uh, market cap. I was bringing you guys this coin when it was at 10 to 12 million to 15 million market cap. This thing has shot up. And it doesn't look like it wants to stop you guys. Volume is also going insane. 16.1 million, up 64% in the last seven days, 59% in the last 24 hours. 0 0.016 is at that 1.6 cent level that we talked about last video. I did make a video on Samoid coin um, a few days back. So make sure you guys check that one out. Um, you guys will see that we called the cup and handle breakout on that one, okay? We also have Miro. Look at this Miro, you guys. 4.4 cents. It's also up 142% in the last seven days and it's up 33% in the 24 hour. We'll take a look at bird eye because I want to show you guys what's going on in the Solana market, the Solana coins and which ones I'm looking out for. I mean, like, let's just take a look at Bitcoin here. It's only at 44k. Looks like it wants to break out right now. Coins are going off. Meme coins are going off. And honestly, the market hasn't the bull market hasn't even started yet. Also, you guys, I want to take a look at total three. So this is this is the reason why I'm saying that we're very, very early still in this bull market. OK, even if this bull market is, has even started, because this could just be a little rally here. We could be consolidating in this area for a bit. This is the total market cap, excluding Bitcoin and Ethereum. We did break out of this long term a sideways channel that we were basically in since June of 2022. OK, and we did break out over this yellow line here this yellow horizontal line and now we're at 452 billion. However, as you guys can see, like it hasn't really made that much of a move yet. And honestly, the top was 1.125 trillion. This will cause a huge run in, in cryptocurrency. Like if we have a run like this with just, you know, an increase of like five, 10% in the, in the market cap for, for a total three, can you imagine what 140% will do to these coins? We are so so early, my friends. Um, really great to see that. Also, total two, same kind of same kind of deal with total two. Total two is excluding Bitcoin, but it is including Ethereum. Same thing. Look, the chart looks very very similar, you guys. This is not financial advice, so keep that in mind, you guys. I'm just showing you guys the the gems to look out for. I'm bringing you guys the news on the market. And on this channel, we cover Solana coins because Solana is the next Ethereum. And I will say it again and I will keep saying it. All right. Solana is going to go to 500 per coin or over in the next bull run. Right now, we're currently sitting at $73 uh, per Solana. I brought this coin to you guys. I was talking about this all during this bear market here. Um, I, I remember I made a video and it was at $21. Now we're at 73. However, I, I want to warn you guys, right? I do suspect a pullback will happen, all right, at some point, because it's inevitable, all right? I believe that the pullback might happen when Solana hits $80. It could be, it could hit this really nice resistance point right here, and it could have a nice pullback because we haven't hit this in a long, long time. Um, and, you know, $80 is actually a pretty big resistance point for Solana. So keep that in mind, you guys. If it does hit $80, we could see a little bit of a dip. The Samway coin has been absolutely going parabolic. If you guys would have followed my, my trading here, um, we were buying it all the way down here. 
all right, in this 0.0031, I made videos on this coin. If you would have bought it back then, you are currently up 400% on your money, all right? So make sure you guys are following, like the video, subscribe to the channel, don't miss any of my videos, because um, I'm gonna keep you guys updated on everything that's going on, all right? Looking at the 30 minute for Samoid coin here, you know, it's looking, it's looking pretty good, you guys. I'm not going to lie to you. Um, the RSI has reset, all right? It's looking great. Um, it is forming some sort of a bull flag here, all right? You can kind of map it out here, but it is sh sh showing some sign of life here. Um, you know, if this is the bull flag breakout, the next potential move uh, could be up here to 2.1 cents. This is the next move that could happen. Um, we are seeing some sort of, you know, there was some sort of hidden bullish divergence here on the chart, as you can see, for this area, for this area, also, it's looking pretty nice, some hidden, hidden bullish as well. If we look at the uh, 15 minute a little bit more closely here. Um, yeah, you know, it's the RSI is completely reset, it looks neutral, it looks like it wants to keep going, it wants to lo looks like it wants to go for this rub run up to 2.1 cents. Okay, guys, not financial advice but that's just what it's looking right now, all right? Uh, the moving averages are moving up really nicely. Everything is continuing, the nice continuation. I just wanna cover Bonk here real quick because Bonk has just been possessed by some sort of demon and it does not want to stop. Um, this is a very dangerous situation though because um, anything that goes up must come down, right? Looking at this right now is kind of a scary chart because look at the RSI. The RSI on the daily is overbought for so, so long. It's overheated you know, and something like this has to cool off eventually, okay? If you look at the moving averages, they're nowhere near the price right now. This has to cool off, okay? It's just inevitable. And it has gone up so much. I think I made my video here um, when it was in the sixes down over here, right? So if you would have bought when I made that video, you're currently up 1,600%, which is basically a 16x of your money, all right? If you would have bought where I, where I where I made that last video at, all right? So, but like looking at the chart here, it's past its all time high. It's at price discovery mode right now. I do believe that there will be a rotation in money and capital in the Solana ecosystem from Bonk once Bonk starts decreasing a bit to other meme coins on Solana, such as Samoid coin, such as Miro. Miro has been performing nicely well as well. You could look at the chart here. It looks very nice performance, 4.5 cents right now, currently up 26%. This is also a low cap, just like Samoid coin. I believe that there will be a rotation in the capital, okay? So keep that in mind. Also, I wanna take a look at some other really small micro caps because micro caps on, on Solana, you know, also they have, they, have been, they have been going up, but I think there will be an even bigger rise in these micro caps because people are looking for really, really small micro caps to make a lot of gains. So. This is the number one contender, in my opinion, Cheens up 35% today. It's only at 1.5 million market cap, okay? This one, nobody's talking about this one. I'm bringing you guys this one first. Cheens is, is really under the radar here, okay? And this one looks great. Also, keep in mind, Pepe Sol, okay? Pepe Sol is another gem um, that's super undervalued right now. It's currently up 25%. But the, we'll look at the fully diluted. It's only 270K thousand for this micro cap, right? And this thing has been a lot, lot higher. I'm talking, you know, I'm talking 87% down from its all time high still, okay? This thing went up crazy in this last, you know, few months ago in May. So it could definitely repeat that. This one hasn't gotten any love yet either. Volume is still super low, but, you know, we are in an uptrend here on, on Pepe Sol, okay? So keep this one in mind. This one looks really, really potentially like it could boom out of nowhere, all right? Samoy coin, it's only at 66.8 million, you guys, all right? This is a huge movement, but the market cap is still small for Samoy coin. It's still only 67 million market cap. Very, very small still, okay? It has a lot more room to run. If you look at the max chart, look at this. These last few, like, few weeks, it hasn't even made a blimp on the max chart. All-time high is at 23 cents. I think we can reach 23 cents pretty easily. What do you guys think? Drop it down in the comment section. Let me know what you guys think of Samoy coin. Hold, uh, the watch list counts have been increasing. Look, over 25,303 watch lists now. It's, it's increasing, you guys. More and more attention on this coin. But if you guys take a look, they did post uh, this update on, on Samoy coin Twitter. 
um, because some people were fudding the coin saying that, oh, the top wallets have too much allocation and, and all this stuff and other coins don't. And this is a more risky play because the top wallets have too many coins. But they cleared it up because it's it's actually untrue if you do your research into this coin. Right. So um, this is what it says. There's a misunderstanding as it relates to 51 percent of Samo sitting in the top 10 wallets. Four of those 10 belong to OKX, Kraken, Gate.io, Tulip. So the, the biggest exchanges. Two of those wallets, which is 1 billion SAML total, they're not real because they were burned, so they can't be accessed, okay? So that's a huge 1 billion SAML gone. And then also the FTX holdings, Alameda. So, of course, like all SPLs, they were involved in Alameda and FTX, and those, those tokens are essentially burned because nobody has access to those. And the team is waiting to claim those tokens back through a legal contract that they have signed with FTX and Alameda. So those are to be received back in probably a few years because legal proceedings can take a while, right? So if you account for the above and recalculate the top 10 holders, this is 51% number plunges to only 20%. And if you strip out the SAMO marketing fund, the figure then drops to 12%. So actually only 12% um, are the top 10 holders, okay? So, you know, a lot of people are misleading uh, the public on this because they think, oh, Bonk is the first uh, the Solana, first Solana meme coin. And that's not true. Actually, Samoid coin was the first Solana meme coin. So there you go, guys. All right. And look at this. This is another Twitter post. Samoid coin NFT. Somebody bought up 50 Samo NFTs, swept the floor on Samo NFTs, 50 of them just like this. This is a huge bullish sign for the project. People are getting interested in this. And if the NFTs upgrade comes out soon, I believe that there's going to be an even bigger rush to buy these NFTs. And I don't want to say anything, guys, but there, there is, uh, this was just posted right now as we're talking. Um, Samo was actually featured in a US Salvation Army advertisement on TV, all right, on YouTube. And it's actually hilarious because one of the kids in, the, in this advertisement, essentially, was wearing a Samoid coin t-shirt, all right? So this is, look at this. This is a Samoid coin t-shirt for a Salvation Army advertisement on television, all right? I mean, you can't make this stuff up, guys. And this is for Christmas, all right? Gifts that mean more for Christmas. Salvo stores, okay? So, I mean, this is really hilarious. This was just posted like a few minutes ago. Um, but, I mean, the, the Salvation Army. So this is really interesting what's going to happen with this. And why why is this kid wearing a, a Samoid Quinn t-shirt? Like, that is so rare, right? You can't just go and buy one. You have to order it. So it's, and it's like, it, it just makes you wonder what's in store for this coin. This is a little bit of a longer video than I wanted it to be. But I just wanted to go over every aspect of what I feel, what I'm, what I'm thinking is going to happen. And... I really appreciate you guys listening. Make sure you guys subscribe, like the channel. Don't miss any of my videos and I'll see you guys later. Cheers.